preparing to emerge from hyperspace. As soon as we drop out, I'll start broadcasting a signal. If the Asgard are monitoring the region, they should find us. Should we not be able to see the planet? Yes. Experiencing the effects of an extremely powerful gravitational force. Something's not right. Teal, turn us around and get us out of here now. Hyperspace generator will not engage. Sublight engines are at maximum, yet we are not moving. There's only one thing I know of that could create this kind of gravitational pull. It's pretty much what we expected. We burned out the hyperdrive getting here. That is most unfortunate. Even if it was working, it would have been very dangerous to open a window this close to the event horizon of a black hole. Are we that far, of course? No. We came out of hyperspace right where we were supposed to. But this doesn't make any sense. Halla's sun wasn't nearly massive enough to collapse into a black hole. Yet that is what appears to be happening. I'll see if I can get a little more out of the sublight engines. pulled backwards. Perhaps if we divert power from the shield. Right now, they're the only thing holding the ship together. We drop them and the gravitational field could tear us apart. I do not believe there's any other choice. Diverting power. We are now moving forward. It's not gonna be good enough. We're losing hull integrity. Greetings. Thor. It is good to see you again, Major Carter. Teal. Likewise. Indeed. Your timing is impeccable. I am afraid I cannot leave this sector, Major. Not at the moment. Thor, you're the only one who can save Colonel O'Neill. As you have said, he is being preserved in stasis at the moment. I will be glad to return with you to Earth as soon as my mission here is completed. What is your mission? I must wait here until I am certain the replicators have been destroyed. You may have noticed that Hala's sun has collapsed into a black hole. Just before the back of our ship was torn off. I'm sorry I did not reach you sooner. I was not expecting you.